Now let's implement the swipe to refresh layout functionalities. We have created before the swipe refresh layout. Now we are going to use its functionality and implement its functionalities. We will start by swipe refresh layout, making an instance of this layout object uh, class, and we go to the initiate views. <coughs> and here we are going to use the swipe refresh layout object and find its ID. Find the view by ID. I have named it before swipe and swipe refresh layout set the refreshing to true okay and the swipe refresh refresh layout set color schema colors r dot uh, we need to implement <coughs> or pass three colors i will create them on the on, uh, color uh, values the orange the blue and the green okay i will implement them here in the color okay let's go to the values folder and let's create the colors that we have passed <clears throat> In this way, we are uh, creating the colors. Orange, its code is FF9900. And let's create three of them the green and the blue, and these are the codes. So uh, we are making this course uh, the biggest course on internet. So please help us by rating us five stars on Udemy and subscribing to our YouTube channel, Master Coding, and uh, downloading our app, Master Coding from Play Store to help us make new videos, make new tutorials and complete these courses to be the most complete Android developer course on Udemy and on the word okay i'm making here the reference and i need to add suppress lint suppress lint this is for the new uh, version of android okay so everything is solved now these are the three colors Swipe refresh layout dot set on refresh listener. This is the <clears throat> thing that we need. And make main activity implement the swipe refresh. Go OK. <clears throat> and this is the method that we are going to use. And in this function, we are going to uh, make our algorithm in order to set the refresh functionalities. So when the user swipe down, it will go and call the on fresh on refresh uh, method. And inside the on refresh method, I will start by making is for from start equal to true and page equal to one and go and call our me method get home data okay so <clears throat> on uh, home data i will go to the update home page update home page here and we have seen before if we if we have created before we have created before this condition if is from start boolean is true go and execute these codes and on response and i uh, i will edit the on failure i will create progress bar that set visibility to gone 
<clears throat> now, set him here, swipe refresh layout dot set refreshing to false. We are dis disabling the refreshing uh, characteristics and the failure of uh, getting the data. So on update data, I will go and make it the same. Okay, <clears throat> so progress bar, we have create before and I will add the swipe, uh, disabling the swipe refresh, refreshing function. Now, let's run it. <clears throat> and here we go, we have implement the swipe refresh correctly. Okay, so the swipe refresh functionality is working fine okay amazing so guys it's very important to understand why we are using these layouts and how to implement its functionality by implementing the interface for the call for the listeners and use the methods that, that uh, are <clears throat> are included to uh, to implement our uh, codes so update and get the data and get the new data are uh, from the refresh uh, every change in categories and posts and news images or anything you will get updated on refresh so try to delete uh, one category from wordpress and swipe to refresh and you will get the updates